so we're just out uh, doing some prospecting and uh, we're uh, exposing some small veins of mineralization amongst all these uh, schists. You can see that the, the rock is heavily oxidized and it's got some, uh, some sulfide staining there as well. So we found a, a small little vein here and then uh, all this uh, host rock here or country rock has uh, disseminated pyrite and looks like uh, may have some chalcopyrite as well. So we'll see how many veins we can find and uh, see how many samples we can pull off and we'll go from there. Okay, so here's uh, vein number two. Uh, it's about one centimeter thick and uh, we're gonna chase it and see what we can pull off of that one and we'll keep looking. So we found two small veins so far, we'll uh, keep looking, see if we can find any more. There's quite a bit of outcrop in this uh, area, so we'll see what we can find and pull off. Okay, so we have uh, a pretty big quartz vein coming through here. So uh, some of it's oxidized. We'll hammer a bit off and uh, see if there's anything in it. Bit of mineralization in there. Oxidization, sulfides, not much, but uh, we'll keep uh, keep looking. You got some mineralization along here. Looks to be like uh, pretty fine grained pyrite.
You know, you got some mineralization right there. Nothing substantial though. More sulfides along here. You got another small vein there. Looks like this continues up there. Uh, maybe we'll take a look up there and see if we can chase it for a little bit. Probably go ahead and take a sample from from here. I got these small little veins going through here, but nothing uh, nothing substantial. All right, we'll continue on. Yeah, a little bit of sulfides. Got a quartz fan going through here, maybe uh, take a look at this. Right where these two come into contact. So we got another uh, quartz vein here. Another one coming up here. Looks like they're pretty much barren though. Same with this one. I got a nice vein there. I would say it's about uh, two to three centimeters wide. Looks to be solid mineral. We'll pull a sample off of here for sure and uh, continue on. I got more sulfides in there. Looks like the vein widens down here. Yeah, it looks like it's about uh, three centimeters down here, maybe four. And uh, looks like it's solid mineral, so we'll definitely pull a um, sample off of here. Send that in. Looks to be like it's uh, pyrite. Maybe a little galena in there. Now you got another small little vein of sulfides here. Anyway, uh, we'll keep poking around and uh, 
might send in a couple samples and we'll uh, put the assays at the end of the, the video when they uh, come back from the lab. Okay, so uh, here's just a few samples that we pulled off from uh, from one of the veins that we're going to be sending in. Uh, looks like it widens substantially. You can see that this is solid mineral. Um, I would say it's about 8 centimeters wide. 8 to 10 centimeters wide. Solid mineral. So we're going to chase the vein and uh, probably send in uh, several chunks of this and probably do ICP analysis um, but uh, we'll determine that a bit later anyway that's all for now if you like the video subscribe comment and uh, be sure to like it and we'll keep posting have a good one everyone